Hey guys, this is the Cajun Colonel Sanders again. You know, most people when they're on a trip, they'll talk to their wife or they'll listen to the radio or something. But that's not what fascinates me. I like looking at gauges, looking at my truck, looking at temperatures, oil pressures, all of that good stuff. Today I'm looking at my exhaust gas temperature while towing in fifth versus towing in sixth gear. And it's pretty interesting what just a little bit of lugging will do to your uh, exhaust gas temperature. So I thought I'd show, show that to you. You can see right here we're towing in sixth gear. We're running about 910 to 920 degree Fahrenheit on our exhaust gas temperature. Two are not really relevant to this conversation. That's your DPF differential pressure and your DPF outlet temperature. But look what happens when we shift to fifth gear. That exhaust gas temperature, which is down in the lower left-hand corner of the gauge, really starts to drop. Now we were running along, and I should have had RPMs up there in one of those other spots. But we were running along in six at about 1,250 RPM. Which is kind of on the lugging side for just doing 60 miles an hour, which is what we're doing there in that little thunderstorm we're running through. And uh, you can see that, that temperature start to drop. But as we go to fifth gear, our RPMs go up to about 1750, 1800. And that's just the sweet spot for this 6.7 liter Cummins diesel. It likes to run right in that area. That's where it's building its highest its highest torque, which is about 800 foot pounds on this 2014 2500 Laramie. So I fast forward a little bit just to keep you from being bored to death while we're watching the exhaust gas temperature come down. But you can see the difference pretty dramatic from about 920 down to about 760, 770, somewhere in that neighborhood. Uh, same speed, same everything, just a shift from 6 to 5th. That 920 degrees we were looking at is nowhere as close to being in the damaging range or anything like that for this engine. But it does give you an idea of the difference. And if you, I guess I've always heard 1200 degrees Fahrenheit is kind of your, your uh, point where you want to start paying attention. But I'm kind of the uh, school, the lower the better. And lugging can really do some damage to your engine. It can it can just wreak havoc on your rod bearings and pistons and everything else. And of course, this is just while towing. When running empty, take advantage of that high gear and that great mile per gallon. And don't worry about it. There's no way you're going to lug empty. So thanks for watching, guys. And give me a thumbs up if you think this has been helpful. Until next time, adios.